Hey everyone, welcome back to JavaScript tutorial. In this lecture, we will talk about a different type of comparison operator. In the previous video, I described there are three types of comparison operator. Now in this lecture, we will take a closer look at comparison operator types. There are three types of comparison operator, strict equality, abstract equality, and relational. We will start this tutorial from the strict equality and after that, at the same time, we compare strict and abstract equality. So, what is strict equality? When two values consider equal if they refer to the same object or they are the same type and have the same value. I personally recommend you to use strict equality when you are comparing two values. We will also take a look at what is benefit of using strict equality rather than abstract equality. To check strict equality values, you can use three equal sign. And to check not strict equality value, you can use exclamation mark and double equal sign. Right? We will take an example after a few minutes. But now, let's move on to the next type, abstract equality. When two values consider abstractly equal if they refer to the same object or having the same value. To check abstract equality, you can use double equal sign and to check not abstract equality, you can use exclamation mark with the equal sign. Now let's take an example of strict and abstract equality. So I will just declare two variables here. First one is a number, so I will say let x is equal to 10, comma str is equal to and in the single quote I will say 10. So the first variable is number and second variable is string. Now I will just print its value on the console using console.log and in the parenthesis I will say x I will specify double equal sign here and specify str. So this is abstract equality. So when you execute this statement then what would be the result? true or false the result would be true because we use abstract equality to compare two values when you are using abstract equality it is very important to understand abstract equality only check its operand values is equal or not it does not check its type and when you convert this to strict equality then the result would be different and you will get false on the console because when you comparing this value with the strict equality, x is not equal to str because of its type. x is a number and str is a string. That is why the strict equality returns false. Using strict equality operator, it will check its operand value and its type. If both variable having the same type and value, then strict equality say true. Abstract equality will just check value in the variable. So if you want to use strict equality, you can convert string into number like this. Just say console.log in the parenthesis, I will say x specify strict equality operator and say number and in the parenthesis, I will specify str variable. So when you execute this statement, the result would be true because x is now equal to str because str is now converted into number right so this statement will convert string into number and the result would be true because x and str has the same values and also having the same type the same way you can compare not equal to value also using strict and abstract equality so i will just say console.log and in the parenthesis, I will specify x is not equal to number and specify str in the parenthesis. So we are using not strict equality operator here. So the result would be false. The best way to compare two values is using strict equality. Strict equality will give you pure result, right? Let's move on to the next topic, relational. Relational operator is also used to compare two values. 
In the previous video, we learned different type of relational operators. We describe all these operators in detail with example. If you want to watch the previous video, then you can click on the top right corner of the screen here or you can click on the link below in the description. Right? That is all for now. We will see you in the next tutorial.